here we are with the mate I recently had a suspicious episode 4 and yeah last episode we got introduced to new characters a girl from the school of the boy do we know his name I don't know and one of his classmates and the butler the female butler of his and so yeah I guess we will see those more often I would guess and I guess we will see what happens in this episode, right? If we see more of them, or maybe just back to the maid and the boy, or if we see maybe new characters. But yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think, and I would say let's get to the episode. Oh! A shirt and a tie? Eh? She changes her... uniform? I mean, it looks good, I would say, right? <clears throat> what? I mean, why why wouldn't you, right? You are the only other person in the building. <laughs> if he wouldn't notice you, that would be very strange. <clears throat> so why is she putting on this, like, butler outfit? Um, because of the other girl we saw in the last episode. <clears throat> I guess we will find out in this episode why she's doing it. Yeah, I guess the other, like, classmate is not, like, <clears throat> interested in him in terms of, like, maybe love or something. Um, I guess she's more, like, interested in the gossip, right? What's going on between him and the maid. I guess she is more into that stuff, right? Um, so yeah. Oh. Never really, I never really paid attention to the intro so far. There is a girl that looks like Lilith in Small. Hmm, interesting. Does young master like pudding? 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 Suspicious, she's cleaning the windows. So, this is more interesting, right? Why did she switch to the butler outfit at the beginning and now she's back in her maid outfit? I work for free. Mm hmm. I mean, we still don't know how she got here, why she got here, right? Following him. You're following me, suspicious. So I do it to you. I know your weakness. What did you... Fall over. <laughs> Jackpot. I won't run away, he says, after he ran away.
suspicious. Independent mate. Hmm. Teasing time. So suspicious. Of course, <laughs> that what he thinks. <laughs> and here he goes again. Yes. And she's blushing. Is she going away? Yep. <laughs> stop teasing him and he won't and he will stop being straightforward. It always happens because she is teasing him and she isn't realizing it. Booba, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> of course it's... Dude, last episode we only had, had him say one time suspicious, and this time he just says it in every scene. Again. Blushing. Oh, sorry that I'm yawning. <clears throat> it's just that I'm awake for so long. <laughs> Busy day today. <clears throat> I mean, I would imagine that it's like really, really... That it would be really rough around a kid like him, right? I mean, she she came here to help him, basically, right? And he's just suspicious of everything. He thinks it's suspicious. Oh. Yeah, that... That sounded very mature. <laughs> In the wrong way, I guess. Okay, so far no suspicious in this scene. Blushing time. What's you what does you want to play? Chess. Okay. Can she play chess? Okay. Didn't she bought him a console? That's also games. I would guess all right. If your parents are barely around and then they come home, then of course you would be happy. If, unless your parents are complete douches, right? Hmm. 
Okay. <laughs> wow. But will it work out? <laughs> Burning kitchen. <clears throat> yeah, he looks nothing like it. <laughs> like them. So he got the looks from his mother, basically. Eye color and hair color and all that stuff. <laughs> Boom. Boomer. And you was a pawn. He explained it? From what I've seen, he just said the names of the figures. <laughs> but maybe we missed the rest. I guess that they survived the pudding, right? <laughs> they didn't die from it. Or maybe that's why the parents are gone. <laughs> Oh, sorry. God damn it. <clears throat> Dude, this anime is not good if you're tired. <laughs> because there's nothing happening, really. <laughs> I guess you can. How many rounds did, did they play? She's sweating. <laughs> Go to bed. Just one more. After the next one, just one more. What's he looking at? Test. He got an F. Ooh. Maybe pudding would be good to cheer him up, maybe, I guess. Yeah. A 
That's how they think, uh, how she thinks it will go, <clears throat> but I think it won't. <laughs> Nani? She wants him to be suspicious. All the tables have turned. <laughs> I don't think so. <clears throat> this is day. <laughs> Why? I mean, of course, she does it right. Why would she say, nah? I don't know why he doesn't want others to, to see her, right? And here he goes again. I want to be together with you forever. I love your eye color. Blushing. Scene change. We are halfway through? Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> I guess she knows. Right? <laughs> really? <laughs> Blushing intensify. Ordinary. Oh, that's why she uses the, the butler outfit. Ah, okay, makes sense. <laughs> so she chose the butler outfit. I think we have never found out how the parents died, right? I wonder, is it like, was it a car accident or something like that? I don't I don't think that it was illness, right? <clears throat> Yeah. <laughs> 
suspicious. Because you don't want to be alone, and there she is, as butler. There, next is the other one. And he's happy. Of course. It's the same one. Oh, she gave it to her. Okay, okay. That's why it looks the same. <laughs> Because you're suspicious. Blushing. Okay, so the mid credit card or whatever wasn't in the middle it was close to the end okay good <laughs> i have to say <clears throat> i guess in this case here i can put my thoughts into the end credits here right now um because it's not much right it's it's a very straightforward episode i would say right but yeah let, let me know what you think right uh, but i would say it's a le very straightforward episode right there wasn't much going on right it's it's it was basically back to formula of episode one and two right where it's like he is suspicious of her all the time then she is teasing him in some way and then he just bursts out and tells him that he wants to be with her or to be with her all the time and forever and all that jazz right and then she's blushing and then she goes away or the scene changes or some stuff like that and then of, of course we had to end with the school stuff um but yeah i would say because of that stuff it's more like a boring episode right where nothing much happens and it's back like to the suspicious part or being suspicious why last episode Okay. Eh? Okay, that's it. Um so yeah, like I said, it's it's more like a boring episode, very because it's very straightforward and basically back to what we had in episode 1 and 2, right? With him being suspicious and all that stuff. And while we had in the last in the last episode, we had like only one time I think where he said suspicious this time he said it like every like two minutes or so right so yeah i'm not really a fan of these episodes i'm i'm because it feels like nothing is happening really there's like no real progress i feel like overall that it feels like there's not much progress um because i mean where is this show going right i have no idea where this is going um Clearly, it won't end up in them having a relationship, right? Because I guess that would be weird. Having, like, a grown-up adult with a, like, what? A school kid, basically? Like, what is his age? Like, eight, nine years old? Maybe ten? Um, I don't think that he will be older than ten. Maybe eleven, I would could guess, maybe. But not older than that, I would think. Um, yeah, I don't think that there will be a relationship or anything going. So, I guess, I feel like this is like one of those animes or shows, or I guess you will never see the 
end for this show, right? Um, there will be an end for the season, but if we get another season, there will still be no end to the story, right? Because I think this is like one of those where it has no end, right? It basically just keeps going and going and going. And it's just another day, basically, and nothing else happens, really. Um, so I feel like there's no real progression, right? So because of that, I th I feel like it's really hard to... It's it's more like a feel-good show, right? Um, but yeah, I would say it's not really a good, feels-good show. Because here, here's the thing, right? For the most part, you have only these two characters, right? You have the boy... And you have Lilith. And the interaction between those twos, twos, <laughs> between those two, whoops, I should stop that. Um, and the interaction between those two is not really impressive, I would say, because, like I said, for the most part, it's just he is suspicious of her, then she, then he confronts her, then she is teasing him, then he blurts out his feelings, basically, and then she goes away or the scene changes. And that's like basically the main gist of it when they have interactions between each other like there are exceptions like the end of this episode for example uh, for example and i mean last episode we had the school part right so we had new characters and that was pretty decent i would say because it's not because it's a bit different right right but <clears throat> if you go by what we've seen the most of the show so far it's the interaction between the maid and the boy right and it's just not that great, I would say. Because when you look at, for example, at Call of the Night, where you have, for the majority, also interaction between Ko and Nazuna, they have good chemistry, they have good dialogue, conversations, conversations. Um, they have good scenes where it's, like, enjoyable, even if it's just the two for the majority of the time. But here it's, like... It feels very repetitive because in Call of the Night, they have so many different things they are doing, right? And different topics they talk about and everything. But here it's always the same. It's, it has the same repetitiveness, which is like the, the boy is suspicious, confrontates him, and yada, 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 right? Uh, so it just isn't feeling that great to watch this. Um, I'm... Still not quite. I'm I'm getting closer to the point where I'm like, okay, I think I drop it, but I think I'm not quite there yet because I guess there will be more characters that will be introduced. I mean, at least one character, and that will be the orange hair girl that we saw in the intro. Um. So yeah, I guess I would like to see at least her introduced, right? Um. And see what happens before I maybe decide if I want to quit or not. So hopefully that is next episode. Um, which would be episode 6. And I think there will be 12 episodes or maybe 13. But I think it will be 12 I would imagine. So that would be the halfway point. And then we can see is it like is it getting better or not. But honestly speaking right now after 5 episodes I think it won't get much better. Um, so I wait for... Maybe for the next time we get a new character, which hopefully is next week, the orange, uh, orange hair girl, I think, and based on that, maybe we can decide if I want to keep going or not. I don't know because I, the thing is also I don't know if I want to because in this episode, like, I didn't really know what to talk about. Right, I'm just sitting and be like suspicious. He is suspicious. Suspicious. Mm -hmm. She's blushing because I don't know what else to tell, what else to say about this. There's nothing interesting going on. I mean, I, I, I mean, I have questions like, why is the mate here? Where is she coming from? Why is she here? Right? I mean, we know some a bit of why she's here because she wants to the best for the boy, right? She wants to support him. She wants that he grows up healthy and happy and all that stuff. But I mean, why did she came here? There must be a reason. How did she came here? Like, who told her to go here? Or how did she found out? And why is it so important for her, right? 
Um, so a bit more of backstory, that would be interesting. Or like, how did the parents die? Because I think we don't know, right? We just know that they are dead, uh, I think. And so something interesting, right? Give us something, <laughs> information. Um, or how are they making money to keep the house and get all the food and stuff when the boy is just in school and isn't getting any money and the maid is working for free, right? <laughs> Even that would be more interesting than the dialogue between the maid and the boy, I would say. But, <clears throat> yeah, nothing really, right? So, yeah, I'll just end it here. I'm it's, I'm talking for quite a bit already. Um, but, yeah, we will see how it turns out, right? <laughs> I guess. So, yeah, if you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe or comment. Let me know what you think about this episode or the show. And I would say thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye-bye.